Alright, we just got done assembling the tonneau cover. Now we're going to put the brackets on the vehicle to install the cover on the truck. We're going to start on the passenger side. Just got the little L bracket with the little flap. The little flap's going to sit on top of the bulkhead and then the hole in the bracket and then the little U part of the bracket is going to line up with the holes on the truck. We're going to do that now. You do the same thing to the driver's side. We've moved to the back brackets. Uh, the most important one is this bracket. You want to make sure that the ball stud is on top and facing towards the front of the vehicle. And then all we're going to do is just attach this bracket using the square holes. It's going to use the, the carriage bolts and then a nylon nut. And then you're going to take your other 8 millimeter hex head bolt and using the factory holes in the, inside the bed, you're just going to take that and then just screw it in. And then once we get the cover on, we'll come back and adjust the height of the flap. Just tighten that down, do the same thing to the driver's side. Okay, to install the cover, there's a little J-hook on the front that we assembled earlier. You're just going to stick that little J-hook into the rectangular hole on the bracket. And then just let it down slowly. Okay, now to do the back latch, you want to make sure you adjust it to where you can push the handle all the way in to where you'll be able to rotate to be able to lock it. So. We want this to go all the way out. You're just going to use your 7 16 and just tighten it down. And you'll do the same thing to the other side. Okay, next is to adjust the, the height of the latch to be able to hold the cover down. So as you can see, we're just going to have it, it's going to sit right on top of the latch. We're just going to go back and finish tightening these up. Just put your finger behind to hold it so it doesn't spin and then just use your tool and then if it does go up like it just did there you're just going to come back over just push it back down and then the last step of the install you're just going to lift up the cover take the hydraulic cylinder and then just push it onto the stud ball that completes the installation of the laser light thank you for joining me and have a wonderful day